name is Amy and I'm a member of the Clackamas Community College Foundation Board. My involvement with the college began when I was six months old and my parents moved to Oregon City so my dad could start his job at Clackamas as an instructor. I myself was a Clackamas student for two years and served in student government as president and transferred to complete my four-year degree at OSU. My husband Alex and I met while we were both students at Clackamas and together we run a successful financial and tax management firm in Oregon City. Alex and I both proudly serve as trustees on the Clackamas Community College Foundation Board, working with a team of like-minded community members to help provide for others what we were fortunate enough to receive, access to classes and training at Clackamas Community College. Scholarships have made it possible for many to achieve their educational goals and career dreams. I would like to share some of these stories with you. Paulino Cervantes and Elizabeth Breton are CCC alumni and scholarship recipients. They share their stories of how these scholarships and Clackamas Community College made a difference in their lives. I want to be a teacher. I haven't decided whether I want to do second grade or middle school. I am getting my AEOT and then transferring over to Western to get a bachelor's in education. Man, without the scholarship, I don't, I don't think, because I, I had a family going through school. Um, it was either work or be able to support, even, you know, contribute to the family. You know, it's not like I could just go to school and not be able to pay any bills. So the scholarship itself um, paid for everything. I mean, it paid for my tools, paid for my books, paid for my classes. Casey Sims is the department chair for counseling at Clackamas. He sees firsthand how scholarships made it possible for students to start college and overcome some of the challenges they face achieving their educational dreams. The scholarships are really important at Clackamas Community College. Our foundation does a great job of raising a lot of money to be able to help students navigate their way through college. One of the most important factors for success in college is understanding the resources available. So I have the opportunity to work with students and find out what they need and help direct them to the different areas on campus that can help them. They changed my life, helped change my life, and helped me to change my life, but it's changed uh, generations of my family also, you know what I mean? Because before, it was a, a lot of negative influence, like I think every male on my dad's side of the family was either in prison or had been to prison, including myself, you know, and my sons and all my nephews were looking the same way, you know? And so when I made the changes that I've made, I mean, I see the changes in them too, you know what I mean? It's, it's a good thing. Uh, my parents are both very hardworking people, but I mean, they work all the time and it's to give me and my brother and my sister everything that we want and what we need. But I know that there is no way that they could afford a really, a tuition, I guess. And um, with my brother also graduating from high school, right behind me, it was going to be really tough to be able to afford two tuitions. So um, getting that scholarship really helped me with books and with um, tuition and fees, everything. It was just, it was great because my first year I didn't have to pay anything out of pocket. Everything was, thank God, given to me. <laughs> um, I don't know if we're able to say that. <laughs> but. Um, so yeah, it was, it, was really, it was really nice. A lot of students expect that scholarships only go to students that have a really high GPA. And the truth is that there's scholarships for lots of reasons. This is a community college and we're for everybody. And a lot of people come here to start fresh and to build a new career for themselves. And so the scholarship committee, when they review scholarship applications, they look for stories of people that have overcome challenges, that are overcoming barriers, of people who are committed to making this investment in themselves. It's important that everybody sees themselves as a good candidate for a scholarship. The college wants to invest in its students, and um, to be a good candidate, you have to believe that you will reach your goals and communicate that to the committee. Very, very easy to just fill out some quick information about yourself, like your name, your phone number, all that, and then you just have to um, write a letter saying why it is that you think you deserve the scholarship. And then two um, couple of letters of recommendation and then you're good to go. Uh, yeah, the scholarship, I mean, without that I don't think I would have made it through school. I mean, especially with having a family, three young kids, um, I still had to pay the light bill, so I, my wife worked, but you know, she's always worked, she's always been there for me. but. Um, just her by itself, it would be a really big burden more than anything, you know. So the scholarship without it, I, I don't think I would have made it to school.
If you would like more information about scholarships or to learn how you can contribute to student success, please go to our website at clackamas.edu.